Hey, my name is Amir and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Zaffle. Zaffle? Zaffle. Zaffle haul. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. I feel like with my Australian accent it just doesn't sound the same. I don't know guys. Tell me how you say it down below because I'm not too sure. But yeah, they reached out again and asked if I wanted to pick out some more things for a video and I thought, hell yes. This time I've tried to pick out some more summery things because most of you guys watching, I have noticed, are from the States. So you guys are in summer at the moment. We're in winter. It's actually like really nice and sunny today. I don't know what overcame me when I was picking things out, but I picked out two bikinis. So yeah, that's that for now. I'm going to quickly pop off and run an errand and then I'm going to come back and try everything on. And yeah, I want you guys to let me know what your favorites are down below and I'll leave everything linked down there as well. And I'm pretty sure everything I got was probably in a size medium from memory. Anyway, before we jump in, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you don't forget. And yeah, let's jump in. So here is our first little outfit. I mainly got all tops. Yeah, I've got all tops and two bikinis. I just got one pair of shorts. So you can see the shorts are just like checkered. They're really thin, um, really lightweight, like summery shorts. Um, they've got actual pockets in them. But yeah, they're like not like super soft material. They're just like that kind of, I don't, I don't know how to describe it. Cheese, cheesecloth kind of fabric feeling. Um, they're kind of, they're pretty flattering though. Because see, they like sit out so they don't like cling to my fat, which I really like. I just saw this in the pile. There is also, does it have little things? Oh yeah, there's little loops. We can pop that on here. Yeah, like I feel like this style doesn't need the belt. Like you could if you wanted, but it also looks like almost maybe a bit more formal without it. Like without the little bow, still cute. I don't know. So this is the first top. It is just one of those like ribbed um, t-shirt, crop t-shirts um, with the white, things around the side. There's adjustable straps, which I love. The quality is like really nice and thick. And um, yeah, it's got honey on the front. So I just seen everyone with like these little honey tops. I thought they looked so cute. So I wanted to get one for myself. I'm not usually a red person, but I feel like I'm just so inspired recently to wear red. I actually do feel like red especially looks really nice with blonde hair. I just popped some black leggings on for everything else because I don't know, I feel like because the other shorts are a pattern, they'll be a little bit distracting since like none of them are really meant to match. So this is our next little top. It is strapless. Um, it's like, yeah, this like really cute glittery thing, but it's super, super see-through. Yeah, when I like lifted it up to put it on, it was like really, really see-through. So I don't know, but what I do like, and I noticed that a lot of my crop tops are like basically little bralettes. This one is a little bit longer, like it kind of comes to the belly. So like you could wear it with something high waisted and it's like not gonna show off too much, but you're not gonna have to be like tucking something in all the time. So this is the next top. Again, this one's like a little bit wintry-ish kind of. Everything else is really summery. This one, yeah, I guess it's kind of a little bit in between because um, it's got the long sleeves. The fabric is like a little bit warmer. It's not like a super summery, lightweight, thin fabric. I love like the bell sleeves and it goes like tight. Is it bell sleeves? Big sleeves, you know? But I like that it goes tighter because I have stuff that's big sleeves like this. And whenever I wear it and I like go to reach it, like reach for stuff. My sleeves like always get in food. I do really like that these don't seem to be like cumbersome. It would sound so stupid, but trust me, like it's something I've come across so many times. So yeah, I really, really appreciate that. We've got these like strings here so you can like tighten it. Yeah, so you could wear it like tighter. Um, if I were to wear it more up like this, I think I would definitely have to wear like a bra or something with it. Cause I, I just feel like, you know, since it's that much higher, as soon as I reach for something, I'm going to expose everything. So next we have this off the shoulder white crop. I feel like it might be a little bit see-through. So I'm just gonna hold myself like this. Um, Cause it's like a little bit thin. Um, it's got these kind of like ruffly edges on the top, on the bottom. I wish it was like a little bit more fitted though. Um, it does feel really secure. Like it's not gonna slip around too much at the top. Um, but yeah, I think I would definitely have to wear um, like a nude strapless bra or something with it because I do feel like it is just like a little bit see-through. Next we have this other black top and I got this in like an apricot nude as well. Um, 
This has like, I feel like this fabric's really thin because this shirt I think is a little bit too small for me. Um, but yeah, these like completely open up down the side here and I had to lace them myself. I don't quite like how these bows look and I did like when this was more open, but it's so cropped, like my boobs completely fall out of the bottom. So yeah, this is the color of the lighter one. It is definitely see-through. I can see on camera that it is very see-through. Um, but the color is nice. I mean, it's almost my skin color. So we have another um, crop top strapless with the little stripes down the side. I'm just really liking this like sports luxe theme that's going on. I mean, it's not really sports luxe, but if you wore this with like maybe some nicer pants and some heels, then it's got that sports luxe kind of vibe to it, where instead of just wearing like all black, you know, you do have a little bit of that sportiness to it. Um, I do think it's really cute. The fabric's like decent. It's not super thick. Um, I don't know, I think I'd probably wear a strapless bra with it just so I'm like more lifted. Um, but I mean, at the same time, it's not like super see-through, so I don't think I would actually like, I don't, wouldn't have to. It would just be like a personal preference type thing. And this is the last top before we do the bikinis. So this one's really similar to the last one. You can see the stripes are closer to the front. I actually like it because like the other ones, you couldn't really see the stripes from standing front on. It's only if your arms moved. Whereas this, it's like a little bit more obvious. It's double lined, which is really nice. Um, so it's not see-through, I don't think. Like I, yeah, I don't think it's see-through. I mean, obviously you can see that it's cold. Again, you can see that it's cold, but it's not like, you know, too um, extreme or anything. I think this is really, really cute and this will look really nice in summer with like some high-waisted blue denim jeans. Oh, and these shoes that I ordered. Yes. But yeah, I'm really, really excited for them. Anyway, um, this looks really nice. This 10 out of 10 recommend if you like this style. So for the bikinis, I think I'm just going to insert just some clips over the top um, because I don't know, I don't really feel like talking and they're standing there, you know, I'd rather just like kind of show a few clips. Also, this red one is too small, so like I would pop out. So it's just better to do just like a quick overview for that one. The other one's a little bit um, better fitting, but this one's a little bit too small. So this is that style that everyone's getting at the moment that has that underwire style. Now, <laughs> I've seen some people try this on and it looks really bad on them. I don't mean to be rude. Like it's just, you know, some styles just are going to look better on other people. Um, I thought this would look bad on me. Like I thought I would be one of those people. And you can tell me if I'm wrong. I might be wrong. I might be biased, but I hate my body in bikinis. So for me to think like it looks pretty good, even though the size is wrong. Like I think it's a flattering fit. This underwire just makes my boobs sit really nicely. I think it's because I've never had um, like a bikini that has underwire so I don't know I just think it sits really nicely but these are like a bit small so like it just covers the side of my nipple as soon as I move it's yeah way too small and the cups are really really little so um yeah this is a medium I definitely could have got and probably should have got a large to maybe an extra large even like a large more and then the bottoms I don't know if you can see I've left the like little underwear seal thing in there just because I'll probably give these to a friend or something um because yeah I think they're just a little bit too small for me um so I get like the love handles as well but I do think because it's like a cheeky very cheeky cut um yeah you see I can you know I can cover them for posing like cover the love handles but like for real life they are you know going in a little bit much to the flab. It's been maybe three years since I bought a bikini and I only wore it on holiday. Um, before that, again, years, like I, I'm not a bikini person. And I think it's cause like all bikinis used to be like hipster things. And cause this is where like, I'm like flabbier. Whereas these like more high waisted ones, um, they sit like in the bit where it just seems to be more flattering. And instead of like cutting across like my fat leg and my fat bum, they kind of just like let it be and just be higher. So they, I don't seem to get as much muffin top. I don't know, I just feel like they're a little bit more flattering now than they used to be, just the cuts and styles, even though they are more revealing. If you want to try that underwire style, I would definitely recommend checking this one out because yeah, the quality is, is quite nice. Like, I mean, there's a few flaws like the padding, but really, I, it's not that obvious when it's on. I think it's actually really, really cute. And like red bikini. I would not normally pick a red bikini, but I just, I was so drawn to this and I love it. I think I'm going to have to get a size or two bigger. <laughs> then we got this marble two piece. So we have, these are like a, a bit fuller. They're not quite as skimpy as the other one, um, but still like a little bit cheeky. Um, so yeah, it's like the marble top, um, not adjustable straps. 
it's like a thicker kind of back it's almost like a little bralette top that I have like similar stuff to that um, and there's like the padding in the front um, it's almost like a little bit small but if I kind of move the padding like right to the bottom and to the side um, it, it seems okay it seems relatively secure on the top um, but having said that yeah it could be maybe a little bit bigger but at the same time, if you wear swimsuit like and actually swim in it, not just like wear it for Instagram, um, from memory, bathers actually stretch and stuff like when you're swimming in them. So I think, yeah, if you're actually wanting it to be like practical swimwear, I don't think that size issue would be a big deal. Then for the bottoms, I feel like these were like a little bit more flat. I mean, obviously these ones aren't way too small like the other ones these are maybe like half a size a size too small where I could go up they're high waisted they have like a lot more coverage but they're still more of that like thong Brazilian butt thing so you can see yeah your butt um, I know that they're really nice quality they feel really nice they're double lined again like really nice I think this is a really flattering two-piece again I don't know why like I used to hate bikinis and I hate my body just as much as like when way back then especially like I, it looks nice in clothes like you know stuff like smooth over but like when it's all open like that I don't know I just I hated hated buying swimsuits and then I just like picked two random ones on Zaffle and like I don't know I think even though the size isn't right like I don't feel gross in them I just think the cut is really flattering so yeah I'm definitely impressed with those but yeah that is that for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed it let me know down below what your favorite from the haul was and if you feel like it let me know what your least favorite was as well I think I it's weird because I didn't think I would actually say it. I think the swimsuits are like nearly my favorite um, the red I think if the red one fitted properly I think I would have really really liked that um, I don't know if I'd wear it in public though, like, I mean, I don't, I don't know, I'm just not a swimsuit person and I never go to the beach, I never go swimming, so, like, really, I don't know. I love that pink long sleeve top, I love the little red honey top, I love this little one, um, I might have to get someone to, like, or maybe I can just do it myself, put, like, a dart in the side, just because I feel like it's a little bit big, I don't want to have to be, like, adjusting it, because I've already had to adjust it a few times just standing here talking these ones here probably are like the least favorite from it so the little t-shirts um that have the lace up the front but yeah that's that for today's video i hope you enjoyed it don't forget to thumbs up subscribe all of that jazz let me know what you want to see in my next videos coming up and um i have a really exciting announcement in my, when is this video going up probably like in, in a week or two, a really exciting announcement. So um, I guess you can try and have a little guess down below. If not, make sure you subscribe to my channel because I am announcing it there first, here first, here on my channel first. The announcement will be there 27th of this month, I think it is. Very excited, I hope you like it. Um, but yeah, anyway, I will see you guys later, bye.